Friday the 19th of February. I woke up in Kentucky. I had to switch up the location. It's, uh, I mean, it's been go time, but it's go time now. I'm here. I'm ready. I'm going to be in Florida March 1st, training with Mitch Piotnik, um, the fastest kid on the face of the earth, uh, next to Usain Bolt. He might even be faster, but I'm out here in Kentucky. I did. I traveled all day yesterday, so yesterday was the first day I haven't completed um, one of the things that I said I was going to complete was the hill sprint, so today I'm going to do double. I'm gonna do double the hill sprints and then I will film the meditation. Um, stay with me, with it all day. Okay, well, so I'm out here in Florence, Kentucky. Here's the dolls. Getting acclimated to the region, the location. I got my wit fit stuff on, but I do train with my foreign dolls. I gotta make sure that these people know who they're seeing when they're, when they're driving. I don't know your boy is fucking grinding. Also got, also got these wrist weights. How you doing? I also got these wrist weights on. That way I'm sprinting. I'm driving my arm, driving my elbows. I keep my hands high. I keep my hands high. These weights are also making my feet turn over faster. So I mean, every day, every day I'm getting better and better. I'm coming up with new creative ways. Right brain dominant, right hemisphere dominant. I'm actually hemi sync. I'm hemi sync, so I'm coming up with new creative ways to get better. And uh, I'm out here, whatever it takes, man. Kentucky, Florence, Kentucky, where I play ball. I'm staying with my my host mother, Angie. She's the most amazing woman ever. I'm um, so grateful for her. Uh, I, I have been struggling. I have been struggling with filming the meditations for you guys. And uh, I have been sticking to it. I've been meditating every day, two, three times a day, four times a day, even if it's just five minutes of your time. Um, it's great to just tune out everything and, and find out who you are and what we are and focus on our breathing and it really helps a lot but as you can see there's this beautiful little creek in her backyard down the, down the little ravine so this is going to be my new meditation spot I'm going to tune out I'm just going to focus on my breathing and uh listen to the sounds of the creek running and, and nature and the birds and yeah I'm just gonna pull these over my eyes honestly remember when we are meditating our spine is always straight in a comfortable position just breathe
this spot, man. I'm grateful, I'm thankful. Thank you guys.